Uh, my name is Andrew Cagney, and I'm from Whittier, California. Hi, I'm Jasmine. I'm from Lady Buzzard, England. I'm Isabel, and I'm from Chico, Idaho. Uh, my name is Mia Sara Perez. I'm from San Juan, Puerto Rico. And so, what exactly got you into the medical field of research? Um, I, I I live in Simi Valley now, and I run track and field. So when I injured myself during one of my track meets, I met my athletic trainer and I really fell in love with sports medicine. Uh, since a kid, I always wanted to be a doctor and I got invited to this program and so I decided to come out here. Um, I took a sports med class, introduction to sports med in high school, my sophomore year, and I really, really enjoyed it. And it, it came easy to me, so I had a feeling and I always had a feeling and an interest in science. Um, I've always liked um, helping people, taking care of people, so once I got to know about the program, a really hands-on activity-based program, um, I wanted to be a part of it. Do you find that critical thinking, having to think quick under pressure, comes naturally to people, or is it learned along the way? Uh, you definitely have to learn like how to um, respond to certain situations before like, keeping an accident. Uh, it's definitely helped me work more closely with each athlete. You know, you see so many that you forget to make a human connection with them. So definitely learning more about uh, patient assessments, human connections. I think it depends on who the person is. Um, some people that comes easier to them and sometimes it doesn't. Personally, I, I like a more controlled environment, but some people like the excitement and adrenaline of that situation. Um, I think it is definitely learned along the way. Um, I think it is really challenging, especially when you have like a lot of people in panic. So I think it's like a really mental skill, just like to keep your calm and do your thing.